On the 15th of February 2017, during a Wednesday prophetic service at Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries, the servant of God, Pastor Ian Love, encouraged the saints and intercessors to pray for a prominent woman who has one of their names as Ndong, whom he saw undergoing serious trials and tribulations. These were his words. Hallelujah. Let us pray for a prominent person who has got as one of their names in Dom. I'll just cut it. Dom. A prominent person. Yes. I see trials visit this prominent person very soon. A person, this person has got one more name other than this Dom name. Yes. So we must pray for this prominent person. I mean, sometime today, when I was praying for this person, all of a sudden I felt tears come to my eyes. I mean, tears. When you are in intercessor, you can find yourself crying, but you won't be able to explain why you are crying. It's a Holy Spirit gift. Hallelujah. Those who are intercessors among us, they know what I'm talking about. A Holy Spirit gift. A grace when you are praying for someone. You may not have communicated with them. But when you are praying for them, you feel tears. Even when I arrived home, I, 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 I was praying for the service. But all of a sudden, I saw this person, one of whose name is Ndom. He's a very prominent person. I, I, I saw the one, this person, one of whose name is Ndom undergo a very serious trial and tribulation in the near future. And I started to weep for her. I'm not talking about weeping metaphorically. I'm talking about the tears, actual tears. But at the present moment, this Ndombi that I'm talking about is very strong. But if this Ndombi is to be caused to fall, this Ndombi person is to be caused to fall, I see a lot of people will fall together with the So we must pray for Ndom. Look at your neighbor and say, pray for Ndom. Say, pray for Ndom. Some people, they think I'm referring to Ndom, my cousin. And Ndom, my cousin, she doesn't influence many people. I'm talking about Ndom, who has got a lot of influence. Hallelujah. Whose welfare can even affect you and me? You understand? Yes. So we must pray for Ndom. It was in the afternoon, since morning, when I tried to pray, the Holy Spirit would bring a picture. I know the person that I'm talking about. Whenever I pray, and then the picture of this woman, it would just come in front of me. And I would kneel before God. And then I would start to cry before God for her. For something which is not yet but something which I'm seeing in the realms of the Spirit. A very serious humiliation. Pain. But there is grace for this Ndom to avoid this pain. God can do it for her. And when God does it for her, because if this Ndom is humiliated, I see that the... We as a nation state can be under the wrath of God. A curse of some son. I will end there. Let us pray. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I thank you. The servant of God, Pastor Ian Love, still urges saints and intercessors to pray for this woman whose welfare determines the welfare of many others, who also has a name called Tindor. 1 Timothy 2 verse 1 says, Therefore I exhort first of all that supplications, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks be made for all men. May the Almighty God bless you.